Hey you guys and welcome back. Today we're just gonna be watching Waddles do whatever he does. Nah, just kidding. Well, actually, thus far. Um, yes. That's good. I need to craft a bed. So, yep, that's first little checklist for today, and then we'll look at getting some better teams than Waddles. No offense, Waddles. You're amazing. Everybody knows that. Although it would be nice to have some extra damage to help out with fights and stuff, but for now, Waddles is the best team survivor. Yes. This waterfall is so weird, it's like because they can run up it. It's kinda cool. Kinda weird. And there's just some like water. Splashing right Crystal. Alright, I collect some of that. So I can make myself a spyglass. This is a force of things. Yeah, I say they're they trying to kill me. That's annoying though. I don't want to die. Alright, so I'm not going to get very much crystal without a metal pick. So that's kind of annoying. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about these guys. These enforcers. Seem kind of slow. Oh yeah, he did take it out. died. Nice. Which means I don't die. Alright, what do I get from mining your corpse? Oh, so basically the same kind of stuff with tech die. Give me a little bit. Besides this robot, it's just bugs. Why well, that Sarko? And I kill it. It's good though, because then I can go back to team. I don't know what level it is though. There's a beaver here. Is there any beaver dams? Distracted. Okay. Craft a bed. These Ankleos can get me out, I think, but they're a little bit stronger than what I was hoping to kill. Ankleos, Trike. Oh, I hear Compy. Where is it? There's gotta be something easy to kill around here. <laughs> Killing moose isn't gonna be that easy. Or deer, whatever. 
careful. Say not if that's the case. Where'd it go? Yeah, I guess I'll kill something. There's a copy. I need 40. Oh, well, here's another one. <laughs> All right, let's put that in stamina. Uh, we'll get ourselves a bowl of. Also unlock mortar and pezzle and stone arrow. Kinda useless to get stone arrow about the bow, but ah, there's something else we can kill. Uh, but then again I could use them to boost the Sometimes I feel bad for these little dinos, like the Dodo and the Listro. They're just waddling around, defenseless. But somebody's gonna get free hide. And me, am I right? Perfect. It's gonna be embarrassing if the only time I die in this series is like from fall damage or Starving or something. So let's hope it's not the only reason I die. Alright, so now that we know those robots are mean, we should try to avoid them. And then. I don't think you can tame these, but you have to like craft them or something, which is, sounds weird to me, but I think that's how it works. Take one of those enforcer guys, but they might be able to do some damage to it and let me run away. Oh, a turtle! Now that's some free uh, meat right there. Yeah, they can fight back and stuff. There's certainly an easier kill than some of them. Sometime. 
the near future. Alright. I'm not sure if I want to unlock bow. Or wood. I think I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get the bow unlocked. Because I can craft that pretty easily. And then get some XP from that. So, that's what I'll do. I'll craft the bow. Some arrows. Go hunting. Then we can level up again. And get some wood structures going. Alright, now that I know those robots are good guys, I'm not afraid of them anymore. Should probably unlock water skin. Because... Yeah. I just die really fast of thirst, if not. Kind of encumbered, so that stinks. Right? It's annoying how loud that waterfall is. One of the many reasons I wish I did not stop my guess here, but it is what it is. To make some stone arrows, I need some flint. Maybe I'll actually place the bed in a better spot this time, which makes it look so weird. Alright. Gather up some flint. I wasn't in the base Here's when that happens. Somebody's gotta go open a door because it smells so bad in there. Alright, do I have enough hide for that? Yes, I do. So I'm going to craft. Yes, that's what I got. Got a little I think I'm just a few rocks short. Oh, nope, there we go. I can craft it. Even inside the base, I'll tell you how hot it is. Alright, so next big goal is to get some tank things ready. So that would be in the trike or maybe that Stego I was talking about. Oh, uh, Stego's, their saddle's pretty high, so it's kind of, well. Level 30, but that's a long time to wait with it not being able to do anything. So I'm going to take a hike and see what I can see. What's that? It's a big smoke cloud. I think it 
That's nice. Grab some turtles. Iguanodon. Two Iguanodons. We'll tame the Iguanodon because it's like how useful they are, but you can't really because there's two. I don't know, I'm just kidding. Let's go see what this most chops wants. Maybe it's moss chops, I don't know. Mejo berry. I think I can get that. Just like the purple ones, right? No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what the mejo berries are. It's so annoying because sometimes it lasts for like all sorts of weird junk, like cooked prime fish. Alright, so. Yeah, nice. One feed. Kind of annoying though, because although they're definitely strong enough to kill a raptor, if you get in a fight, they'll just run instead of actually doing anything. And there's a parasaur. I wonder if I should tame them. Oh, level 55. Alright. He's definitely worth taming because of the weight stat they have. I mean, they're otherwise kind of trash, but. That weight stat is definitely something that's a plus about them. <laughs> On me. Yep, I knew it. I have to catch up with them now. Wherever he is. Which way did he go? Oh, there he is. I see him. Yeah. Oh, sorry, bugs. I saw you. Got you. Gaming percent percentage by a little bit, but that's okay. Uh, let's put that into crafting skill. We can work on our uh, hunger and like waste that and health that later. And uh, I'm gonna have to run back to base because we need water. That stinks. Back to base. Uh, Carnotaurus. Oh. Let's see, he had some arrows for me, a spear, berries that I can eat. There you are. shortly. I need to mark my path. It's not super far from my base, but like, this is confusing. This map isn't quite as vertical as Aberration is, but it's almost as vertical. Put on the tame tracker. Oh, crud, did it wake up? Oh, man, that would stink. That means I have to go and knock it out again. 
Maybe it died. That's probably more likely. Well, let's see if I have any engram points I can use. At least I get the moss chops. Yeah, I'd say it died. There's an enforcer. This is kind of close. That's a lot of enforcers, actually. Again, I don't really know how strong they are. They, they probably are stronger than a raptor, but I don't know. So they're like a. They're kind of like pike dinos, where there's like something living inside of them. Not sure what exactly. Another Carnotaurus. So this area is a little bit more dangerous than the base side. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna hang out here. There's a lot of enforcers that way. So, I'm just gonna assume that Parasaur died. Rip Parasaur. Alright, so I'd say those guys are not that strong. If two stegos can kill them with the assistance of a spear. Not sure how much I really did, but all right, upgrading time to wood. Well, as soon as I get back. I did cut a bit out where I was doing some crafting and stuff, so you guys didn't really miss too much though. Like I got some gloves, some water skin, that I'm going to have to use right now because I'm still going again. That's pretty nice, like, they're so close to like, my bases and stuff. Actually, I have no clue why they're this close to my base and stuff. <laughs> it's 
so the usefulness of the dung beetle is like they turn poop that you put into their inventory into fertilizer which is kind of nice I mean they also give you some oil stuff so I'll need this guy eventually when I like start farming and stuff I'll bring you guys back when I finish taming that iguanodon though hey guys I brought you back uh, cause I finished taming the Iguanodon, uh, and the Dung Beetle. Funny thing is, uh, the Iguanodon was kinda killed by some Triceratopses. So, next episode, we're gonna have a funeral for him. And you're not gonna wanna miss it, cause it's gonna be a great service. His, actually, I think his will hurt. Nah, yeah, it doesn't matter. Either. But, uh, yeah. You're not gonna wanna miss the service. One time lock signs. Hopefully it should be next episode. It should be a lot of fun, so I have to grab once. Um, craft a sign, and open the grid. I didn't think I'd have to do it this soon in the series, but we have a casualty now. And we're gonna have to mark their grave, whether I want to or not, so... Yeah, I'm not gonna wanna miss that. And I went ahead and named the dinos also. It's a sad one to do something funny. I watched that time. <laughs> it was funny because a um, Dilophosaur tried attacking it and it hit the trikes and the trikes just destroyed it immediately. So, we'll have something to do next episode. Maybe we'll get some revenge on the trikes or maybe we'll take it. We'll see. Um, but yeah, see you then. Thanks for watching. Uh, please like the video if you liked it and uh, subscribe if you aren't already. See you next time.